people become allergic very, very early. So think, think about how we could know this piece of information. Most times we know that someone's allergic when they've eaten an allergen, had a bad reaction and gone to hospital. So trying to figure out what happened before that is difficult because we don't know of the, you know, out of 100 people, maybe one or two might become allergic to peanut, right? Um, and it's been very difficult for us to pin those down. And, and the things that we have found that have made some associations, for example, like peanut oils in baby oil, uh, those things resulted in changes. So you won't find peanut oil in baby oil anymore because of the possibility that you might be sensitized. And researchers found that out and we enacted changes to you know, avoid that potential issue. So um, I think these large epidemiological studies are likely to reveal new things in the future. But for right now, I, I think the bigger issue is how can we engage in prevention? And then how can we engage when people are allergic to basically stop them from being allergic and give them the opportunity to live a regular life.